In this video, I'm going to show you how the old AdBeat interface compares with the new AdBeat interface. On the left side of my screen is our old interface. On the right side of my screen is our new interface. In the old interface, as soon as you log in, you start on the Network Top Advertisers tab. In the new interface, you start on the Top Advertisers page. This new Top Advertisers page has all the same data you're used to, but now it's much more easier to use. In the old interface, you change the device, country, date range, and network by using these dropdowns. On the new screen, you use these dropdowns here. To see ad tags on the old screen, you'd click the small plus button. On the new screen, you just click on show ad tags like this. Searching for an advertiser, publisher, or keyword has remained pretty much the same. The search box is still at the very top of the page in the new interface. Now let's look at the top ads page. To get there in the old interface, you'd click on the t this tab here. In the new interface, simply click on the top ads in the left navigation. You can also get to the top ads page by searching for a keyword. I'm going to search for insurance and show you what I mean. Okay, so let me show you what's different. On the old interface, to see destination URLs and publisher, you'd hover and click on these small DNP icons. On the new screen, we've made them much easier to find by putting them right next to the creative. We've also labeled them Show Destination URLs and Show Top Publishers. To get a report of this screen, simply click on this reports icon. Now let's look at the Advertiser Profile page. In the old interface, if I click on an advertiser, I get taken to the Advertiser Dashboard. In the new interface, clicking on an advertiser takes me to the new Advertiser Profile. We've completely overhauled this page to make this data easier to understand. In the old interface, ad spend by network is here. On the new screen, it's here. Top categories, publishers, and channels in the old interface are here. They can now be found here by searching this dropdown. The similar advertisers, recommended publishers, and recommended channels in this area can be found by clicking on the Similar Profiles section here. Top phrases are seen here. They have been moved to the Creative panel here. The Ad Spend graph is seen here at the bottom of the page in the old interface, which has been moved to the very top of the page in the new interface. So it's the very first data point you see when you come to the Advertiser Profile page. To see an advertiser's top ads and top publishers in the old interface, you'd click on these tabs. On the new screen, you can click these links. Notice how on this new screen, you can see more creatives on your screen and more data about each creative. This is one of the ways you'll be instantly more productive with the new Abbey interface. To see the full-size creative, hover over any of these thumbnails. If I move to the Top Publishers section, again, you can see we've made this much easier to use. You can easily see the publisher's name and network here. You can hover over each thumbnail to preview the full-size creative. And you can click on Show Ad Tags and Show Top Placement URLs to get even more information. Now let's do a quick overview of the Publisher Profile page. You can see this screen in the new interface is set up in a similar manner to the advertiser profile. Ad spend by network and top advertiser bar graphs are shown here. They are now combined in this panel on the new screen. You can use this drop down to see the same data you're used to. Notice there's also a new line chart that shows ad spend over time. The rest of the new publisher profile is similar to the new advertiser profile we just covered so I'll leave that to you to explore. The very last thing I want to point out is where to find your bookmarks and reports. In the old interface, you'd use these tabs here. 
in the new UI, you can find them easily right here. And you'd be happy to know any old bookmarks or reports you created in the old interface have been carried over to the new AdBeat. That's it, we're done. Keep in mind, this was a very quick overview designed to get our veteran users up to speed on the new AdBeat design. For more detailed videos that teach you how to get the most out of AdBeat, you can access our learning center located here under the gear icon. Thanks for watching, and if you have any more questions, please email me at jared at adbeat.com.